So Stuart, uh, another good win on the road for you today, your, your thoughts on again? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I think the first half are excellent, um, we're worthy of a 2 up goal start, it probably could have been maybe even further ahead in the first half which was excellent, we knew they'd come out, uh, we knew they'd, they'd, uh, the manager would give them uh, a few words at half time uh, and I thought we'd start the second half really well for five minutes, we're in their box, we've got a couple of half chances, maybe do better with a couple of positions we're in and then again we just lose uh, a really sloppy goal, uh, it lets them straight back in the game and they've got their tails up. We get another one, again we need to just defend the cross better when it comes into the box, we don't. And then you're thinking, here we go. But the reaction to that and is outstanding. Uh, and we're going to get the goal, it's a fabulous goal we score. Uh, worthy of winning any game with Craig. Uh, and then we're, and we're, after that, we're, we're a wee bit back to the wall, but I thought we'd defend great from there. Uh, and yeah, we're over the moon to get a uh, win at a very difficult spot against a team that's just coming off the back of three wins as well. So that tells you that they're in a, a good vein of form. Uh, and it's a, a good one for us. It was a tough couple of weeks, obviously, Hamilton and then down at Queen's. So to come out with three points, we're, we're over the moon with that. And I think the last time we spoke, we were talking about injuries and stuff and, and having all these Andy Steves and stuff. You must be really uh, happy with the way that particularly uh, Matthias has is, is kind of uh, had a big influence on the game. Too. Again, outstanding at left back. Uh, I thought even when Luke came on, Looks like he's going to be a big player for us. Uh, left side there, composed on the ball. He's got a presence about him. Uh, and Miller Thompson, Miller Park was outstanding as well. He runs from deep, running beyond midfield is what we've been asking for. Uh, and if you tailor that, I thought Kane was outstanding as well up top there for 65, 70 minutes. Creates a second goal out of absolutely nothing. So, uh, uh, yeah, a lot, lot to be pleased about. Again, still need to do, look at the goals, see how we can defend better. Initially stop crosses to start with. Uh, and we'll work on that because ultimately we don't be scoring three goals every game away from home to get a, a result. So, uh, but but character wise was outstanding. Uh, and there's been a good feel about it this week, uh, and the boys turned up today, so it's great. Yeah, and just to catch up on obviously last week, uh, another tough uh, away day mm -hmm. uh, on, on the road. I, I, th I think we we'll probably decided it would be a bit, be a bit more, I guess, conservative for. Defensive, we went kind of 4 5 1, uh, isolated Rory up there because we'd had them watch and they're a right good side. Hamilton passed the ball, so we thought we'll give them a space with the ball uh, and we'll stay in the game. And we did that, and then they've changed to two up front last 15 20 minutes. To be fair, they've got a couple of chances that they could probably score, but Craig's got a chance, a half chance towards the end, uh, and it could have made it an early finish. So we knew there were signs last week that, that we were turning the corner a bit, still got a, a way to go. Still got boys to come back as well. There's still a few out injured, uh, and once they're back, it'll give us a real competitiveness about the all over the park. Obviously, uh, Terry Masson missing today. Mm -hmm. but I thought uh, Miller Thompson. Outstanding. Uh, the three of them. I thought uh, Midge Miller and Craig Brown were, were outstanding first half as a midfield three on a very big pitch. I might add on a very hot day, uh, but their energy levels were, were great. And obviously, Terry's a big loss to. This. He's one of our most important players, so for these guys to step up, and, and that's what we're asking now. We're asking the squad to step up. We've still got some big players to come back as well, and who will need to fight to get back in the team as well. And on Terry, is it is it short term, long term? We're hoping short term. Yeah. Uh, we'll get that assessed as the week goes on, but we're hoping that'll be short term. Obviously, it's a cup next week, so uh, we'll, we'll probably uh, shuffle the squad a little bit next week. Give guys that haven't been playing a run uh, to keep their levels up because it's important when at games like this where we need the four or five subs going on and giving us what they gave us here today. Like Paul goes on, then he's used as a striker. Uh, and that's what it's going to be. It's going to be that throughout the season. It's tough games against good sides. So, uh, yeah, we're, we're certainly uh, in a, a lot better position tonight than we were <laughs> uh, last week. Uh, but it's, it's one win. It's one win. We've got a tough game next week, Cove away. And then we've got two home games, which uh, I guess uh, we're home for them. It hasn't been great uh, this season, so it's something to sort out as well. So talking about Cove next week, obviously it's a change from mm -hmm. from the league back to back to cup, and obviously we played played them a couple of weeks ago. Mm -hmm. uh, approaching it any different? Uh, I think we, we need to be wary of the way Cove played, and I thought they were better than us uh, within the game. Not a lot to start with, and they get their goals, uh, and then they're a better side second half. So we, we might adjust the way we play a little bit. Uh, but we'll, we'll go there, we'll freshen the team, there's no doubt about that. The guys that haven't been starting games will be starting. Uh, and then we'll look to get a reaction. And ultimately it's a cup game. We want to go as far as we can in this cup. Um, because 
when you're in any comp competition, you want to try and win it, uh, and we're no different to anybody else in this cup. And that's why we've got a squad of players, so we'll, we'll shuffle it a little bit. Uh, we'll get some fresh legs in because it's been a hard, hard fortnight for the guys. Uh, training wise, we trained really well this week. Hard training Tuesday, uh, with them at top of the fitness, and they've done that. So there'll be a few tired legs on the bus going up the road, I've no doubt. Excellent, thanks. Good, Brian.